Marshall Stanmore 3 Review The Marshall Stanmore 3 is an improved version of the last iteration, although the differences aren't drastic. It has some upgrades you'll want to learn about. The skip track button and power switch now have new designs, Bluetooth has been upgraded to 5.2, and the sound has been optimized for a wider soundstage. This powerful device requires a large surface area, measuring 350 by 203 by 188 mm and weighing around 4.25 kg. It must also be placed close to an electrical outlet, as it doesn't have a battery. The build is strong and made from 70% recycled plastic and vegan materials. Nonetheless, it's not waterproof, so you have to be wary of spilled liquids that could damage it. Marshall amps provide iconic style and equally impressive sound. This generation comes with a 50 watts amplifier for the woofer and two 15 watts amplifiers for the tweeters, creating an even fuller soundstage than before. This powerful speaker will fill any room with music and more. Its built-in dynamic loudness feature ensures your music always sounds great no matter what volume you set it to. You can still make out each detail even when it's turned up loud. Marshall's sound is typically used to amplify rock music because they specialize in this type of tuning. Each guitar strum and thud of a drum draws you into the song even more when you turn up the volume. Adorned with an iconic rock and roll design, the Marshall Stanmore 3 has all the details to look incredible. The small-sized amplifier features a metal grill on the front and leather around the edges, alongside a gold-brushed metal panel across the top with adjustments for volume, bass, and treble. Of course, this is rounded off with Marshall's classic logo written in gold cursive across the front, leaving no doubt as to what speaker this is. When listening to podcasts and connecting them to the television, really detect a variation in audio performance. With the Marshall Stanmore 2, it was tough to hear spoken words with precision. However, there were far fewer problems in understanding what was being communicated this time around. Even so, it is still best to listen to talk-based content using a soundbar. If a powerful, aesthetically pleasing sound is what you're after, then the Marshall Stanmore 3 could be ideal for you. However, if you require features such as voice control or multi-room capabilities, this speaker may not be the best choice and another option should be sought. Previously stated that there are two approaches to customizing the audio. One way is with the knobs on the control board, and the other route is utilizing the Marshall Bluetooth smartphone application, obtainable for iOS and Android. You get comprehensive command over both bass and treble, while some options offer even better control over a 3 or 5 band equalizer. Those two should be sufficient if you're not an audiophile. If you already have a second generation model, I don't recommend upgrading since the changes are minimal. On the other hand, if you're buying it for the first time, the newer model is worth the additional cost.